It's a Sasquatch! Well, hello everyone, Dan here with Dan Her Prospecting here. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome! I hope to earn your subscription today. I'm back here on my dream claim. This is day two on our dream claim. Day one was a bust with a high banker. If you want to watch the video, go back and check it out. Day two, we decided to change things up. Come back to Nugget Bar here with the detectors. I got Mike and Pete down there. I'm up here. We're gonna find a nugget. We better because yesterday was awful. Today has to be better. So wish us luck and I hope you enjoy. So what I'm doing right now is just taking the Gold Monster 1000, thanks to the guys from Kelly Co, taking it and going down in between all the rocks and checking things out. I just had a little bit of a signal right here, but when I moved the rocks that were on the surface, the signal went away. It wasn't there anymore. So I'm just gonna continue going down in between all the rocks, and then I think I'm gonna go and clear this section here of big rocks, and maybe that section over there of big rocks, and detect right through here. My biggest nuggets were found right there and right there, so I'm in the right spot for big nuggets. Detecting wasn't showing me anything, so I just pulled out a shovel there, filled up a pan, come down on bedrock. Let's get one pan under my belt. Maybe my luck will change. the tiniest little signal up in this little crevice. You know, bedrock one side, bedrock the other, there's a little hollow in the middle. Tiny, tiny signal there. So let's hope it's a huge piece of gold. Wash it down a bit with water. There is no signal left in there. Hopefully it's my pan somewhere. <laughs> yep, something in my pan. Let's we'll see what it is. It was a very tiny signal, so if there is a piece of gold in here, it's not going to be a huge nugget. Here we go. The moment of truth. Just the screen went black. Fine. Denied. Will the second pan from that hole did have some gold. What is that, five, maybe six pieces there? They're small, but hey, it's better than we did all day yesterday. High banking, and this is only in one pan. So I'll continue on with this for a bit, hoping for some bigger pieces. So Mikey just got a good pan too. Kind of like what I'm getting. Pete's getting a little discouraged over there. Pete, come on on, come on dig with us. We're getting it. So this pan looks to have some okay gold in it. So this creek is not known for its little gold. In fact, you find very, very, very little gold. Yet for some reason today, I'm on to the little stuff. But you can't complain about that. So we just rolled a big rock over, and underneath the rock, <laughs> I have a signal. And it's actually one of the better signals I've seen today. Goes into the gold range, zippy enough. That's worth digging. So it definitely looks like I found the sort of catch for fine gold around here. Again, all small stuff, but you know, 10 pieces or so.
Hey guys, I think I found something. I got really tired of uh, padding over there and finding nothing. So I just, you know, grabbed the metal detector and wandered away and uh, just cleared off a little bit up here and got a great signal in a place that I have found nuggets before. Straight in the gold range. Right there. There's something sitting right, right there. We may have to take all this material and put it in a pan to find it here, or a scoop and you know, detect it and stuff, but there's definitely a signal. There were rocks on top here. There were big rocks. I didn't have a signal when I went over the rocks, so most likely it's a small, small piece of gold. Right about there. Okay, let's get a scoop in a pan. Okay, it's a small pan of stuff. Won't take me long to pan it out and see if I'm right. It could still be a piece of lead. Because lead should, looks exactly like gold on the detector. After all that hype, it's going to be a piece of lead, isn't it? No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> oh, there we chunk. are. What a chunk, guys. <laughs> what a nice piece. I didn't think it would be that big because the signal wasn't that strong. Oh, look, it, it's um, it's sponge. Oh. It's like so fresh. It's not been pounded by the river much at all. Oh, that might give us another uh, a second wind here. We we were getting pretty darn discouraged. Okay, do you hold that, Pete? Don't drop it. I'm gonna just pan out the rest of this to see if there's anything oh, okay. else. I know where we're going, guys. Where we're working next. Nothing else in the pan. <laughs> what do you think, Pete? That's awesome. Well done, Mikey. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, that's why it's called Nugget Bar. That is fresh, fresh, fresh gold. So we're abandoning over there all that fly poops we were finding. And what we're going to do now is we're going to just take the rocks, all the loose rocks. We're not going to destroy the greenery, right, Pete? Nope. No, exactly. Oh, we're we're going to take the loose rocks, take the loose rocks and bring them down. And then we're going to detect this whole bank. I found my four grammar right over there. I found another one grammar up here, a couple of pickers. Uh, right behind me is where the eight grammar was. There is big gold here. Let's forget the little stuff and get the big stuff. And we have another good signal. Nice and zippy, I like it. We got another big one, or another good, good piece of gold right there. It's easier if we just scoop into the pan and pan it out, but I sure like seeing them on bedrock. That, is, that just makes my day is when I see them sitting on the ground. I just put it all in. Rocks and all at this point. Yeah. Yeah. Got the detector, Pete? Go over that one spot again. So if it was right on the surface and we got it into the pan, it may have been small enough that the detector could have been close enough to detect it here, but not close enough to detect it in the pan. So there could still be a flake there. Okay. But the fact that we've lost the signal now tells me it was a pretty small piece of gold. Come back, Pete! Come back, Mike! Come back! <laughs> so when we were scooping it, we obviously bumped it and it fell down and there oh. it is on the surface, there right there. It's a little flake. It's a nice, nice flake. Yeah. There yeah. we are. Okay, and no, 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 there's good, there could be more, and now you got a good one in there. I was ready. We're going to take the pan hey. from you. Go <laughs> pan her out and hope for two. So there's piece number two from that bench. Not nearly as big, but still very nice. So after I found that nice nugget, the boys have had a hard time finding pretty much anything today. I've been detecting all over the place, trying to find them something. We just found a great signal. It was actually a combination of about four little signals all together. I had to run back. That's why I'm out of breath. Grab my camera. Pete's panning it right now. Of course, it was on the far end of the bar. Oh, While well, he's panning. I'll show you where he dug. Right there. The signals were right on the surface. This is bedrock. And it was right on the surface. There was like half inch of material. They were small but strong gold signals. 
<laughs> now I'm out of breath. Go, Pete, go. Mikey got one big flake earlier. We detected one yep. big flake for Mikey. Yep, I got my goal for you. He's been skunked so far. I see gold. Look at that. We've got five nice pieces in there. Not even a couple little, little. Well, those were counted in the five. Okay. Well, there we go. Five nice pieces for Pete. Pete is not skunked today, and now he wants to go back and dig more. Well, we just decided that since our plans for high baking this weekend are kaput, that this little spot right here seems like a great place to come tomorrow and hammer hard. If Pete got five nice pieces in one tiny little area, who knows what else is there. So that's the plan for tomorrow. Let's see what that holds. I have found a one gram nugget in that exact spot. So there could be big gold there too. So some fine gold for the day and a nugget, a really nice nugget. That thing is amazing. And you can definitely tell from the structure of it, it is very, very fresh out of the rock. Let's go weigh it, see what it weighs. And here we are, the moment of truth. Is this at least a one gram nugget? No, 0.866. It definitely has the size of a one gram nugget, but because of its structure, I can see how it can be a bit less. Well, that's it for today. We found one really nice nugget, five or six, you know, good sized little pickers there, and, you know, had a lot of fun. Some good exercise too. Enjoyed the outdoors. Hope you enjoyed our adventure. If you did, please leave me that thumbs up. If I haven't earned your subscription already, I hope I've earned your subscription now. And a big thanks to everyone for watching, especially my patrons. Because of the support of my patrons, I get to make weekly episodes of Van Herd Prospecting. Hope you're all having a great day. And until tomorrow, in that spot right there. Bye. Ah, ah. No one needed to see that! <laughs>